underway. Don't you just love playoff hockey? Listen to this place. Let's get after it. Vegas looks to move the puck from their own end. Taken by Gudis. Shot! Oh, great reflex pad stopped by Hill. Read that perfectly with the poke check. Takes a couple of knocks and loses control. Grabs the puck. Puts it on net. Anaheim's looking to break out of their own end. Through the neutral zone and along the boards. Here they come. I don't think anybody was hanging on to the puck after that hit. Sends the pass over. From point blank range. Scores on the rebound. He puts it. James, these are the kind of pesky goals that create a ton of energy for your team. The rebound pops out after the shot. You have to have the hard stick be heavy on it with it on the ice battling to compete for it. He does it and he buries it. Anaheim's talked a lot about getting off to good starts, and look at this, case in point right here. Well, yeah, you get up by one goal early in the game, and it just creates momentum all around your bench. Everyone gets on the ice. They want to contribute. They want to be the one to get the goal on the board and continue to increase this lead. I think they've been real effective to start this game. The Ducks have been dominant in the shot department here early in this one and lead. And off the draw, they win possession. Here's a short pass to Stevenson. They've got some momentum here. Here's the pass. And that's intercepted by Lindstrom. Anaheim's working hard in all areas of the ice. Defense is structure, and it needs to happen in all three zones. When you're talking about stick positioning, you're doing a... Well, you can't do that, or you're going to find your way marching over to the box. Penalty coming up as the play's blown dead. When you're down a goal, you can't generate any offense if you're short-handed. They're going to have to be opportunistic, find a way to kill it off, and then reset the momentum. Anaheim set in their power play unit out for the first time tonight. First power play opportunity of the game. You know they've worked on this in practice to set up the look that they want. Let's see how they move the puck around the perimeter and look to attack. Big save. And they finally get it out in a much-needed break for the D. Puts it on net. Denies him. He got all of it. Anaheim's got possession here in the offensive zone. Just a smothering attack here in the offensive end. And listen to this play slide up. Really want to look at this last save again, James, because this is about taking it to the next level. When you have this level of competitiveness, athleticism, and desperation and urgency in your game, you know that goaltending coach, they can't just teach this. This is instinctual, and this is what winners are made of. This power play group really has an opportunity to smell blood in the water. Yeah, all I have to do is look at the body language of the fatigued goaltender right now, James. I mean, they've had puck possession. They've had the majority of it, and they found ways to move the puck and create opportunities. Now they just got to finish. And they managed to clear it. Grabs the puck and moves on out here with this man advantage. Quick feed to Kalorn. Moves the puck to Fowler. But Toronto's going to play it against the half wall. Here's a chance. Stopped by the goaltender. The shot's coming from the middle of the ice, and he hit has some heat on it, but he's ready and waiting for it. He's all alone. Oh, it just kind of muffles that one. Well, he muffles it because he's in tight. When you're in tight, you run out of room, and you run out of option as well. You've got to find a way to get the puck to the net. Hill's going to hang on for a whistle. Stevenson's ready for the draws. They will continue to try to kill off this penalty. The Golden Knights win the draw. Scrum ensues along the boards. Takes a spill onto the ice and loses the puck. Dumps the puck in. The Ducks have it against the wall. From right out of midair, he bats it down. Higgs almost out of the box. 
The Ducks' power play has expired. Both teams now back at even strength. Well, that's just a great sequence of events with that power play unit. The way they were moving the puck, the execution with their passes and the scoring chances that they did get. Hey, sometimes it doesn't go in, but if they continue that, you got to figure their numbers are going to go up. And he feeds it down to Carlson. Loses his balance on the play. Down the left wing and into the offensive zone. Moves it quickly over to Eichel. Oh, what a little stick lift on the play and comes up with the puck. Quick pass to Strom. Passes out front. And he denies that great opportunity there. The Golden Knights move it ahead. Look out, here they come on the attack. Kids in front. And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Taken along the wall by Stone. Anaheim's got it in their own zone. Along the half wall with the puck. Fires it! Oh, big time save by Hill! Goaltender spent so much time doing tracking exercises, and it's utilized right here as he knows where this puck is coming from, and he makes the save. Moves it to Haig. Great reach with the poke check by Gudis. And that one's denied! And officials right on top of that one, calling for a slashing penalty, it looks like. And the play is whistled dead. Here's the call. Tough spot to be in. You need momentum, and you give it back by going on the PK when you're trailing by one. Anaheim's got another opportunity here on the man advantage. Power plays more time on the ice. The ability to get that puck moving. These players know exactly what they're doing. They work on it in practice. Spoke to some of them earlier today at the pregame. And they talked about the execution and the precision in particular with their puck movement. And does it again. Well, you know that he's a fierce competitor. And he battled to make consecutive saves there, James. Special teams so important. Can they capitalize on this power play here with a faceoff? The Ducks win the draw, and they go on the attack here in the offensive zone. Howden swooping in on the attack. Into the corner of the attacking area. Here's a short pass to Wah. Off the glove, and the puck skips away. Wah's gliding in for the face-off as this penalty kill will continue. The Golden Knights will go to work here in the offensive zone. Great reflex on display tonight on his part. Referee signals penalty coming up here with a delayed call. After the first power play unit was unsuccessful, the second unit will come on. They'll need to be urgent here as the clock is winding down, but there's still time to get one in. Such a tough penalty to take in the game's within reach. They're looking for the equalizer. Now they find themselves shorthanded. The Ducks roll out their man advantage unit, and they've got lots of time with this five on three. The long five on three, yes, you have more time, and you know that you've worked on this in practice. The coach wants you to be patient with the puck, but they want you to find an opportunity. Score! This first of the playoffs, and the rookie kids have done. Well, every athlete wants you to establish themselves as a playoff performer. Well, the rookie, an impressive start to leading a lasting impression. Still some precious time left on this power play as they get set to drop the puck. Anaheim's won the draw and they take possession here in the open ice. Sets it out in front! And that's stopped! Catch it along the wall by Henrique. The Golden Knights get a hold of the puck under man. Gets it out of his own end. Retrieves the puck, trying to kickstart this power play. Along the right wing, they enter the attacking area. Lugs the puck into the offensive zone corner. And he was right there to make the stop on that play. They move the puck out of harm's way. Henrique's got it in the defensive end. From their own end, trying to kickstart this power play. Great heads up play in the neutral zone by Stone. Anaheim's got possession at center. 
And the puck leaves the zone. Offside the call. We'll get a face-off coming up. Petrangelo's fantastic at defending in one-on-one -on -one situations. His shutdown zone ability, guys, it allows him to stop the opponent from getting a good scoring chance when they're coming in against him. Here's a shot! Wanted away. Strong defensive effort. Vegas will try to kill a few seconds off this penalty. Puck clears the zone. Sends it in on the attack. Here's a chance to clear the puck from his own end. Can't maintain possession. And they clear the defensive zone. Oh, and here's the pass. Glove save. Goaltender covers up and will get a face off. Polisarts recognizing they're still shorthanded here as they get ready for the faceoff. Howden standing up, ready to go. Quick shot! That's gloved by Gibson. There's the whistle as the puck is frozen up. Here in the back half of this period, Anaheim's got a 2-0 lead. The Ducks win the draw here in their own end. And the PK unit gets their man out of the box. That's a great job by the PK to have the ability to be aggressive and strong on the puck. And now he tries to get it across to Carlson. And he takes the feed. Great stop by the goaltender off the glove. What a fantastic save from a high danger scoring area, James. And I mean, he's bailing his team out. They have to do a better job of protecting the middle of the ice. Quick feed to Barbashev. Scooped up along the wall by Kalorn. Passes it over to Fowler. Anaheim's got a hold of the puck. Broken up at center by Stevenson. Moves it quickly over to Barbashev. Slick feed. Through pass ahead. The Golden Knights get a hold of the puck along the boards. Gains the zone on the left wing. He grabs the puck here at the point. That's a great heads-up play to break up the pass. Poked away in the neutral zone by McNabb. And he's taken down the official's arm, signaling for a penalty. Here comes the call. The Ducks are getting two minutes for tripping. The Golden Knights get their man advantage unit out there for the first time tonight. First opportunity on the power play in this game. And specialty teams are the difference so many times in a game. Huge for them to set the tone and really get the setup and the looks they're looking for. Quick pass to Carlson. Oh, what a beautiful glove save! Stone's known for pickpocketing puck carriers and sending the play the other way. That's his joint zone ability, guys, and he's so good at it. Smart read on the play as both centers were tied up on the draw. Big time stop! Gibson's been outstanding. I mean, he gets to position to be able to make that point playing save. Moves it to Carlson. Scores! And they capitalize with the extra player on the ice, and it's a power play goal. Well, using the advantage of having extra ice available to them, James, that's why their most skilled players are on the ice. That one's executed to perfection. Vegas is right back into this one after that strike. And they've created some much-needed momentum, and it's amazing what one goal can do to your opponent. Apply some pressure. Eichel's quick stick lands on the puck here at center. Vegas on the attack. The Golden Knights will play it against the boards. Here's a short pass to Theodore. Oh, stopped it! What a save on the play! And there's nothing technical about that. That is all about the will to find a way to make that save incredible, James. The Ducks move to the offensive zone. Oh, that's tremendous poise in the defensive end to break off the pass. Anaheim's got the puck. Poked 
knocked away by Marchessault. Anaheim's got a hold of it along the wall. Poked away at center by White Cloud. Suttering pass! Scores! What an opportunity of the Clippers! They get to the shot off from those coveted area on the ice right in front of the paint. Doesn't allow the goal to get set up and gets it home. Just here in the late stages of this frame, Anaheim's got a two-goal lead. They'd love to build on it. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. Great defensive effort with the stick. Puck grabbed by Lacombe. Shot! Vegas gains a hold of possession. Howden's got it on the offensive end. Lacombe's got the puck now in his own end. Jones has it along the boards. Sent in deep, and the forwards will go to the bench. Carrick's been really impressive tonight, in particular on that last play, James. I mean, the wherewithal to keep your eye on the prize, eye on the puck, and just redirect the puck to the net. I mean, that's attack mentality, and he has it tonight. And that's blocked in traffic. Spectacular stop by the goaltender. How did he hang on to that? Oh, look at this. They are really starting to apply the pressure now. Quickly over to him. And it's picked up by the defense. Vegas has possession of it now. Center and feed. And that's intercepted. Anaheim's got him along the wall. Play whistle dead. Penalty coming up. The Golden Knights are getting two minutes for elbowing. on the power play, I think they'll offer it in the same fashion, James, in that 1-3-1 setup where they look to work through the flanks because you know they've got some lethal shooters on this team. Vegas gains possession under man. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. My goodness, what a save by Gibson. Face-off coming up as the puck goes up and over the glass. Can they capitalize on this power play? Here comes the face-off. And they take possession off the draw here in their own end. Sends a pass over. And that'll put a bow on the first 20 minutes of action here tonight. We've got lots more still to come. Second period is just around the corner. Seeds teams are on the ice. They're ready to drop the puck here for period number two. Anaheim's won the opening face-off, and their power play continues. In close! Scores! And that's his first goal of the postseason ever. And he'll take it. It's much needed, too, James. You get to the playoffs. You want to make sure that your teammates have trust in you and you have trust in yourself because you want to be an impact player. That's a nice start. It's been on a string all night, Cheryl. Huck's been on their stick, and their opponent's been on their heels. They've just been worn down with the offensive zone possession time. And how about the goaltender? Seen so much rubber tonight, and a lot in the netting. Swoops in off the wing to grab the puck after the centerman tied him up. Vegas plays it against the boards. Scores! Well, they needed something, and that clearly was something, Cheryl. That certainly was, and there's some pushback, but they're going to need to layer it because they've got to get closer than within two if they want to find a way back in this game. Well, it takes hard work in the intangibles to get available for a one-timer in that low slot area. You know it's going to be a grind, and you have to fight for your space. He does a great job of it and buries it home. 
Vegas looks good on that play. Now can they do it again? That's a timely goal, James. A very stagnant game for this team. Really not a lot of fire, not a lot of juice. And they get that one. And so that should elevate the heart rate a little bit and get it all pumping in the right direction. Quick feed to Theodore. And he takes the pass. The Golden Knights gain the zone. Angles it over to Eichel. Battling for it along the boards. Vegas has possession of the puck. Denies him on the slapper. Theodore's determination on the puck, even though he stumbled and has a lack of balance, really shows right there, James, as he finds a way to get that pass through to the shooter. Great save on the one-timer! There's the whistle as the puck stopper elects to hang on. Still plenty of time left in this frame. Vegas would love to answer back with a quick strike as they still trail by a pair. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. A little bumping around but still maintains possession. Moves it quickly over to Barbashev. Anaheim's got the puck in their own end. Takes the feed. Oh, good slot of the puck to knock it down. Quick pass to Petrangelo. Takes the feed in the middle of the neutral zone. The Ducks will play it in their own end. Receives the pass. Sends it over. Kicks it away with ease. Slides the puck over. Quick pass to Stevenson. Pokes it away in his own end. Handles the pass. Vegas has it near the wall. And now he angles it across to Barbashev. Nice poke check. Anaheim's got control of it now from their own end. And he's ridden off the puck. Carlson's taking it from his own end. Slides it diagonally to Haig. The Golden Knights cross the blue line and are on the attack. Oh, what a blocker stop by Gibson. And we'll get the whistle after the goaltender hangs on. Inching closer to the midway mark of the period. The Ducks lead it 4-2. Was won the faceoff here in the offensive zone. And that takes Guts to get in front of that one. And he slides it quickly to Amadio. And he sends it across to Carrier. Great use of the body to knock him off the puck. Gets it over to Wah. Takes a shot. Stops that one right with the team logo in the chest. Anaheim's got the decided edge in the shot department here tonight in the second period, and they continue to lead. Offense is own face off, and he wins the draw. He scores! Talk about staying with the play! Well, it's all about being strong. You have to have that center of gravity, but you also have to have a lot of core strength to be able to ward off your opponent and shield the puck like he did. And as a result, it winds up in the back of the net. He is so incredibly difficult to knock off the puck, James. He's got that wide face, which means he's incredibly strong. He's got a low center of gravity and extreme core strength. He's able to get to this puck and bury it. The Golden Knights have got one back, and does this change momentum now, Cheryl? It better. They started the second period absolutely flat, James. They're getting outshot. They need to find a way to hound pucks and get some possession. Some good stick work to force that turnover. Anaheim's got the puck in the defensive end. Here they come inside the neutral zone. Tried to make a move, and the puck hops away. Terry's trying to get a little too fancy with the puck there, and as a result, he loses it. Oh, and a good textbook hit there. Works it across to Eichel. Carries the puck through the neutral zone. Moves it to Stone. Oh, a clutch save! Oh, and it's another save on the play. Quick pass across to Terry. Tried to get 2Q with it and loses possession. Puck picked up by McNabb. Vegas looks to break out in their own end. Here's a short pass to Eichel. Long jam in front. That's broken up. Handles the puck. 
They go on the attack from the left side. Tries to feed it over to Fowler. Oh, to Marisa with the paddle save. As a goaltender, you want to make yourself as big as possible, and that's exactly what he does right there and just takes away the net. Quick feed to Jones. Loses possession after he takes a little hit. Picking up steam in the offensive zone. Moves it quickly over to Gudis. Moves the puck along the half wall. And he gets in front of that. Tries to get it over to Theodore. And he takes the feed. Angles it over to Theodore. Great heads up play with the stick by Gudis. Gaining momentum up along the side. The defenseman will go off as the puck is dumped in. And they continue to apply pressure here. Quick pass to Petrangelo. Through the neutral zone up along the wing. Slides it diagonally to Wah. Feeds it on over to Carrier. Shot with the stop. There's the whistle as the goalie hangs on. Anaheim's coaches were preaching lots of shots on net, and they have done it and lead as a result here in the second. Vegas wins possession right off the draw. And he takes the dish. Huge play in his own end to come up with the puck. The Golden Knights are in transition. Quick shot! Too much traffic in the lane. Trying to escape the pressure. Takes the knock, but he's still got the puck. And that pass goes off a stick. Excellent stick work on the play. Scores! And look who's at it again. Well, it's the second of the game. Too bad you can't bottle these games up and just recall them whenever you want because he's been all around the net. You see players working from this area all the time. In fact, it's a quick snapshot. Though he can't get set to position in time, and it winds up in the back of the net. extended the lead to two here in the second. And I think they need to continue to play desperate. Don't sit back. There's a lot of runway left. Continue to take control of the game. McTavish has won the draw at center. Takes the feed. Great pass from off the right side. Takes a shot. Stops that one. Takes the pass. There's another stop. My goodness, the pressure really building here in the offensive end. And there's the whistle as the goaltender will give his team a much-needed rest. More than half the period has gone by. Hope you're enjoying this one. The Ducks now lead by two. Howden's won the faceoff. Vegas plays it along the boards. Knocked away with the stick by Lindstrom. Shot! What a chance, but can't finish! Well, you gotta make good on a chance like this. This is deflating, James. You don't even put it on the net and test the goaltender. That's a huge miss. Points up! And off the post! Moves it to Strong. and we are seeing it in full effect. And we're only, what, halfway through this game here, period number two? Yeah, it's pretty impressive, isn't it? I mean, the confidence at which the entire lineup is playing with is outstanding. The puck's on their stick, they're working their magic, they're manipulating their opponent, and they're filling the net. And he uses his reach to disrupt the play. Quick shot, and that's blocked. Grabbed along the boards by Kalor. And he comes up with it. Setting up behind his own net now. Vegas moves it ahead. Here's a short pass to Wah. Scores! And a little sign of life here on the ice as they try to get back into it. Yeah, a little bit of a momentum swing right here. And now they've got a layer, which means they've got to have that next shift where they attack and have the mindset to drive the net. Let's see if it's sustainable now. Vegas. 
Rodriguez has woken up late in the second period, answering back with a goal of their own. Just takes one thing, that goal, to make a difference in a game and switch the momentum. As we all know, the game of hockey is all about the ebbs and flows and managing the momentum. Puck is dropped and we are back underway. Here they come on the attack. Quick feed to Martinez. Back to the blue line. And the shot dies in the traffic jam. They gain the offensive zone from the middle. A chance in front! Great defensive heads-up play to pick it off. The Golden Knights move the puck in the defensive zone. Vegas plays it along the wing. Here's a pass in front! Oh, and he comes up with a stop. Works it across to McNabb. Gibson's going to give everyone a chance to breathe and hang on to the puck. Eichel's looking to get his team back in this matchup, guys. His zone ability is a part of his game he can use to complete that objective. The Golden Knights win that offensive zone faceoff. And the puck escapes the zone, and they'll be forced to tag up. And now it's grabbed by Martinez. Picked up along the boards by Stone. Great poke check on the reach. Anaheim's got it in their own zone. Quick pass across to Lacombe. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. Oh, ball moved by the goaltender as he pokes it away. Well, that was an A for effort, James, as he tries the Michigan. He's unable to execute and finish because the goaltender slides across and makes the save. And that's denied by Hill. Picked up along the wall by Carlson. And down he goes as the puck goes free. Hill is opted to hang on to the puck for a faceoff. The Ducks have generated plenty of quality scoring chances and a big reason why they lead late in the second period. Carson's won the draw inside his own end. Tries to feed it over to Stevenson. Moves the puck. Here's a shot. It quickly over to Petrangelo. Quick stop! Scores! At the buzzer, and they get one! Well, coaches always say the first minute and the last minute of every period are critical. Well, now they've got momentum heading into the next frame. they got to carry it forward. Vegas gets one back here late in period number two. Where does it go from here, though? Finding a way to get it done, and they're within one, and that is huge timing for this team. As they drove, they've been aggressive on the puck, but most importantly, James, they're disguising their shot and attacking the net. Well, two periods down and one more still to come. Third period action right after we get a clean sheet of ice. so far. Vegas has had a strong 40 minutes of play, James. I really like their aggressive nature around the puck. They've owned it. They've controlled it. Now it's about execution. They find themselves drilling in this game despite their dominant possession numbers. Now it's about getting it to the back of the net and getting back in the game. The power play unit goes right back to work. Power play scored earlier tonight, and that gives you so much confidence heading into this one. You know how you executed the first time. They'll look, be looking for those same openings. Knocked away by Petrangelo. Terry's got it in the offensive zone. Pucks it away to stay on the attack. Can't keep a hold of it as he's jostled off the puck. Here's a chance to get it out of their own end. And he's able to move the puck across the blue line and out of harm's way. Slides the cross ice pass. Vegas will try to break out here shorthanded. 
Puck scooped up by Howden. Fires it on net. And the lane's clogged up blocking that. Down the left wing, across into the offensive end. And that one's turned away. The Ducks will play it against the wall. And pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. And that somehow stayed out of the net. Solid hit on the play, and that knocks the puck off his stick. Hammers it on net, and he stops that cannon there. Wow! Puts the puck on net, and he scores! And they strike once again with the extra attacker. Wow, this is, again, a potent power play. And two things you need. You need creativity, but you also need structure. And the players know exactly where they need to be to set up, to work their magic around the perimeter, and then open up the lanes to attack the net. The Ducks jump out to a quick start here in period number three, doubling up their lead. And there was a different sense of urgency, wasn't it? And they get on the scoreboard, so now a true goal lead, and that's quite a deficit for their opponent. You can see that they're just deflated right now. Vegas plays the puck along the boards. Petrangelo's got it in the corner. Eichel's looking to complete the hat trick. He's got two in the game. He's looking for his third. Moves the puck inside the offensive zone. Takes the feet at the back end. To the low slot. Nice save from point blank range. Here they come on the attack. Oh, he gets a blocker on it. What a stop by Gibson. The goaltender is very aware of where that puck is in that low slot area and defends his crease by getting out, being aggressive, and taking away any of the net. The Golden Knights gain possession in their own end. Poked away from danger. He looks deep to Silverberg. And that puck leaves the zone. And we've got an offside with a face-off looming. Anaheim's benefited from lots of shots on net here tonight, and they lead it early in this third period. Carlson's won the draw. Sends the pass over. Anaheim's gained possession. The Ducks take it along the wall. Great save by Hill! Great positioning by the goaltender to redirect it to the corner, getting it out of danger. And play rolls on as he came up with a nice stop there. They just keep coming in waves here in the offensive end. Big time collision there. Tremendous puck control here. Oh, that misses the net. Has some physicality here. Stevenson's got it along the wing. From off the wall and onto a stick. And that's blocked from someone in front. Moves the puck into the attacking area. Angles it over to McTavish. Shot. Reaches out and pokes it away. We have to have a ton of confidence to try and pull off the Michigan. I mean, the way he cradles the puck and gets it up on his stick. You know how often he has worked on this in practice? Just unable to execute because it's a great save. The Ducks gain control of the puck. Shot. What a stop. Slides the puck across to McNabb. Grabs it in his own end. Passes over to Wah. And he's tripped up on the play. Referee's hand goes up here. And skilled use of the stick to poke the puck away. And here comes the judgment from the official. The Ducks are going to be shorthanded, tripping the call. They've worked on this setup in practice on the power play. It's already worked for them this evening, James. You can certainly see the confidence that they have in this particular setup. And man, has it been effective. The Ducks have possession shorthanded. Working to shake the pressure from the defensive zone. And that's off the glass and out. And there's one non-negotiable if you're going to be on a PK, James. And that is you got to get the clear. And this is done perfectly. Taken here by Carlson. Made the stop on the play. That's a fantastic save by the goaltender, but his team has to do a better job of protecting the middle of the ice. Those high danger scoring chances eventually go in. The Golden Knights gain possession. Slides it diagonally to Eichel. Slides it across. Big save by the goaltender. A chance in front. Scores! There it is on the power play. The 
power play has been really efficient tonight, James, and they're really gaining momentum off of it. And often when you're drawing this many penalties, teams start to play different against you. Let's have another look at this, James. Yep, there it is. I mean, look at that net front presence, just the screen and the goaltender battling to find the puck. That's exactly what you need in the paint on a power play, and as a result, they score. The Golden Knights have suddenly put themselves into striking distance to even things up here in the third. And it's tough when you're on the other side of this. You can feel the wave coming, and you're not sure how to stop it. So they have to find a way to continue the pace and put them on their heels and just attack the net. Pass back to the point. Oh, just a great heads-up play by Eichel. They gain the zone from the left side. Puts it in deep. Scrum along the wall. Vegas looks to get things going now with the puck. And the puck stopper hangs on to get a breather here for the team. The Ducks continue to lead here in this third period. They've been the busier team offensively. And they win the draw on their own end. And he takes the feed. The Golden Knights have it now. Vegas has the puck. Looking to make something happen along the boards. And that's off a stick. Can't keep a hold of the puck after that play. Anaheim's through center and now in the offensive end. Works it across to Stone. Nice stick work to knock the puck loose. Inside the offensive end now down the left. Puts it on net and he makes the save. Anaheim's moving it up the ice. Here's a chance. Oh, big time save by Hill. He carries the puck up along the wing. And he keeps possession. That knocks him off the puck. The Ducks have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Gaining momentum along the wing. Feeds it over on the rush. Stones him on the play. Here's a chance. Man, James, he shows incredible quickness right there as he makes one and then the second save. Both teams readying here for the faceoff. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Trying to shake loose. He's in. Lindstrom's moving the puck through his own zone. And a smart heads-up play to put that away by Martinez. Quick pass to Howden. Well, this game looks like it's going right down to the wire, James. And one of the most important things to do now is make sure you make good blue line decisions. Just slide. Gibson's going to hang on to the puck for a whistle. Anaheim's attempt to put four pucks on net has paid off as they lead it in the third. The Golden Knights will start off on the attack after winning the draw. Oh, it stays out as it goes off the inside of the post. Hey, has got to be so frustrated, James. He's hit the bar a number of times tonight. Just when he thinks it's going to go in, here's the medal. Goaltender covers it up and we'll get a reset here. A big face-off here inside the offensive end. Carlson's won the draw here, and they'll go on the attack. Slick feed. The Ducks take possession in the defensive end. Taken along the wall by McGinn. Inside his own end, moves the puck. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. Moves it to Carrick. Here he is with the backhander. Dismissed that chance. From the opposite point. Oh, and it just gets a piece of it to keep it out. The Golden Knights will play it from the defensive zone. Vegas has it against the half wall. And that's intercepted by Jones. Sends a pass over. Taken by Gudis. A chance out front. Dishes it off again here. And that's stopped. Handles the puck at the point. Good defensive effort to poke it away. From the left side, they enter the attacking zone. 
Anaheim's top trio continues to impress James. They've had a lot of motion in the offensive zone. They're having a ton of fun showing that chemistry, a lot of zip. And they've been productive, a reason why they're on top. Scooped up along the wall by Theodore. And that skips away. Oh, that's the play. Again, it was absolutely incredible. You're under pressure, you're under attack, really under siege, and you find a way to get to the puck. This is the stop that champions are made of. Anaheim's offense, the story tonight as they lead it here in this third period. And off the draw, they win possession. Ned is knocked off. We'll get a face-off here. Teams are lined up, and we are ready to take this draw. And off the face-off, they take possession. Petrangelo's got it against the boards. At center ice now. He grabs the puck. Anaheim's looking to break out. Handles the pass from the right side. A spirited battle along the boards for the puck. Chance in front. And he there it is. He scores. All over the rebound. And he tops it in. This is what you call having a nose for the net. You take the initial shot and you get front of the net for your own rebound. That's a great tenacious goal. The Golden Knights take possession after that neutral zone face-off. Here's a short pass to Wah. Takes possession. The Golden Knights really need a goal here. They pulled the goalie and the extra attackers out. Great positioning by the defender. Can't stay on his feet after that hit. Slides the puck to Eichel. And a stick in the lane deflects that one away. Great pressure on the offensive end by Terry. Huge steal in his own end. Seconds of this one, and the home fans certainly appreciate that they got their money's worth tonight. Quick feed to Kalor. And there's the final horn bringing this one officially to an end. 1 1. And if you ask anybody going into this series if they'd be surprised where the series would be at, at this point, I think everybody would say no. Yeah, I know. And I would say no, you would say no, because we that this might go the distance. And when you're best on best, your players have to respond after a loss, and that's exactly what happened. They brought them now square even, and now it's back to the grind, and it's going to be a real and fun and entertaining series here, James. We know it's going to be back and forth. Well, that brings the night to an end, and we will say goodbye here from ringside from all of us here at EA Sports. My name is James Sabolski. I gotta get to bed. See ya.